What's up, guys? Nick here from Toad Hall Books and Records. It's time for the new vinyl roundup right here on the Toad Hall Books and Records channel. Where we go over all the new and restocked records every week right here on the channel. This week is, like every other week, lots of new, cool, fresh stuff. We're going to start off with this big old box I got here, which were pretty limited. Doctor Who Hornet's Nest, which compiles five classic stories um, this is the complete time, the complete on vinyl for the first time ever, 10 140 gram yellow and black vinyls. It's the five original audio dramas from back in the day, the Tom Baker era stuff. 265 bucks, but you're getting five full stories. So I know maybe you guys aren't familiar with, you know, Doctor Who isn't super, super is, you know, big here as it is in uh, UK, um, but we do have some hardcores around here. You know, they've been putting out these Doctor Who uh, audio dramas or like stories on vinyl for the last couple record store days. And wouldn't you know it, this last week, I think I sold out of two or three of them. So I don't know if there's a real Doctor Who resurgence going on right now or a lot of buzz about it, uh, but Doctor Who's doing really well again right now for the first time in a couple of years. So something for the Whovians out there. Well, let's go over here. We got Roxy Music, Stranded. They've been reissuing all the Roxy Music records. Uh, 180 gram, Half Speed Master at Abbey Road, $31. Also, you can check out these and all of our new vinyl over at ToadHallOnline.com. I'll put the link in the bio. You can click on that and check out what we got. Mandy Moore, Real Life. Maybe you remember her from the 90s. She's all grown up now. She's got a kid. You know, she's a mom now. 24 bucks. Now, I know a lot of you are just gonna pass over this album, but I've gotta tell you that she's on Verve, and like Kurt Vile, who's also on Verve currently, they've got a resurgence, and they've refined their sound, and it's a lot, it's not pop in the way that you remember it. Uh, it's a lot deeper record, it sounds, uh, obviously a lot more modern. She's not making uh, radio jams anymore. Let's put it that way. These are, there's actually some pretty good substance here. And if you give it a shot, stream it or something, I think you're gonna find that you probably like that new Mandy Moore. I know it's crazy, but it's true. It's actually really good. All right, how about this? This is cool. Animals Reimagined, a tribute to Pink Floyd. $28. It's Two, it's a single LP, and it's got a bunch of people covering the whole album. So Pigs on the Wing, one and two. Sheep, pigs, three different sides, and dogs. And it's on limited edition pink vinyl. And look at all the people on this record. Faster Pussycat, greatest hits, $38. Friday Music, who's been just plowing through the 80s records, uh, 38 bucks. Pastor Pussycat Records, hard to find. Electric Mud, $37. A record I haven't had in stock in quite some time. Muddy Waters Electric Mud. This is the Gatefold, doesn't say, 180 gram colored white vinyl. White colored vinyl, I like that. Gregory Porter, water. Brand new Gregory Porter. If you follow the newer Age of Blue Note Records, the newer stuff, $37. You can check this out. Uh, they're slowly getting through his catalog, getting it all out on vinyl. Just a new reissue. I think it actually came out in 2010. Yeah, it says 2010. Otis Rush, Cobra Recordings, 56 to 58. $25. Look how young he is right there on the back. 25 bucks. All right, here's a new heavy hitter. The new Black Keys, $26. I am, I believe, this is the indie exclusive on white I'm holding. I will have to confirm that. Um, but we do have the indie exclusive on white. It is $26. Next up is one of the Verve Acoustic Sound series. Duke Ellington meets Coleman Hawkins, $40. Always amazing records. Acoustic Sound Series, 60 bucks. 
single LP, gatefold. All right, Stone's got a big old box. $141, so just to get that out of the way. But I'm reading inside A, B, C, D, E, F, G. So you're getting a lot for your money here. And this is a cool die cut cover. El Macambo, 1977, celebrating 60 years of Rolling Stones. This is the first ever release of the legendary 77 shows and features a full set from March 5th and three bonus tracks from March 4th. It was recorded professionally by the band in front of just 300 people. Limited, limited edition heavyweight 4LP black vinyl. Look at that cool die cut. That is cut. Yeah, I don't ever see it. $141. All right, this was the most heavily allocated record this week. Slipknot, Iowa. You're looking at the only copy that I have to spare. I had a pre order on one, a couple of them. And this is it. $41, $31. Soon to be highly collectible. This is on translucent green vinyl. Back from the Dead, Hailstorm. We talked about this record last week. Exclusive Ruby vinyl. I know, it's been doing well though. 23 bucks. Single LP gatefold. Dance Fever, Florence and the Machines got a new album. The new exclusive, indie exclusive gray vinyl. $41, two LP set. And it just says side one, two, and three, which makes me think that it's an etching on side four. Does not say. Uh, but it does say that Jack Antonoff and Florence herself produced this record. So Jack Antonoff from Oh, is he from Fun? From the Bleachers. I don't remember. It's from one of the modern kind of rock bands. B.B. King, Run With The King, restock, $31, two LP set. B.B. King and Eric Clapton. The Cure, Pornography. We have the picture disc left over from Record Store Day. We can buy the regular old black vinyl for $23. J. Dilla Donuts, sell out of these almost every week, 25 bucks. The album, it contains two 12 inches with a total of 31 tracks. Wow. Space Hog, Resident Alien, maybe remember the this from the 90s. In the meantime, was their only radio hit, although the album was pretty darn solid. Uh, this was a Record Store Day reissue. This is the pink vinyl pressing for 43. Oh, we already did the animals. We got a restock on Blood Under the Red Sky, Dylan, for $24 which I haven't had in a while. Keb Moe's got something out. Good to be. Translucent red vinyl, $31. I love the hat on the old bench seat and then he's driving the car behind some horses there. I dig that. BT Express, Roadshow Recordings, 74 to 80. Kind of to go along with the Otis Rush record, $25. You can get both of them. Reverend Horn Heat, Horton Heat. Laughing and Crying, limited edition red vinyl, $27. I think it came out originally in 2009, um, and this is 2021 Yep Rock. So. Here's another Reverend Horn Heat. Green vinyl, $27, originally 04. Get those for those rockabilly kind of fans. Blink-182 Buddha, look at the colors on this record, $36. It's on green, red, blue vinyl. Split. A tri split. Very nice. Aaron Lewis frayed at both ends. I think this is a special order, but I think it's going to do well. Red and blue vinyl, two LP set. $26. I love the affordability there. This is a restock from last week. Half hour power, the, the 741 record. $40 on that. This is an import. This is from over the ocean. Here's another Roxy Music, $31. Half Speed Mastered, 180 gram. They've been, this is, now we're getting into the really popular stuff. Queens of the Stone Age, Lullabies to Paralyze, $36, two old piece set. It's just a restock. Perfect Circle, self titled. I haven't had this, no, this is Mirror Denams, $37. If you're a Tool fan, you know all about it. Um, back in stock. Sturgill Simpson, Cutting Grass, 2 OP set, $26, where he covers his own songs in bluegrass style. And yes, we still have Volume 2 in Indie Exclusive. This is just the regular version, but we still have the Indie Exclusive of Volume 2. You can pick them both up on the website. Dock of the Bay, Otis Redding, Dock of the Bay. 180 grams sitting on the Dock of the Bay, 
26 bucks. Here, kiss me, kiss me, kiss me. $36, two LP set. Just another great restock. Your Talking Heads records have been extremely hard to keep in stock lately. $36. The name of this band is Talking Heads, their classic double live album. $36. What hasn't Dream Theater put out lately? $48. Bucks, you get a three LP set. This one is. Uh, oh, it has concludes the album on two CDs. Original demo tracks. This is into Infinity Demos 96 to 97. Forrest Gump soundtrack. Oh, here's a new one for us. $33. Two LP set. Oh, it's loaded. Birds, Leonard Skinner, Doobies, Seeger, Doors, Jefferson Airplane, Simon and Garfunkel, Wilson Pickett. Enough said. Art Pepper 11. MJC, Modern Jazz Classics, $31. Craft Recordings put it out. You know it's going to sound good. 180 gram vinyl. Guys, I sell, I, I think I'm the only person on the planet selling this record because I sell so many of them. I, I'm the only one pushing it, maybe. I don't know. It's This is a phenomenal record from 2011 that is like my store favorite. It's 16 bucks. Listen to this record. It's It's so good. I saw a lot of those. Lumineers Brightside, the latest Lumineers record, $26, 180 grand, pressed on black vinyl. It's got some restocks here. Mumford & Sons Babel for 20 Their second record. Primus Sailing the Sea of Cheese, $27. Primus Records always selling out. Have not had the system of a down since before, or since 2021. $25, single LP set, Toxicity. That's going to be a hot title. In Excess Kick, 23 bucks, single LP, six time platinum, 180 gram. Well, it doesn't say 180 gram. Might be standard weight. Just a couple left. We got the Jane's Addiction Ritual de la Habitual, $33, single LP. Bruno Mars, Unorthodox Jukebox for 24. Locked out of heaven on this song. On this record, the cult Sonic Temple. Fire! Yeah. Smoke she is rising. Thirty-five dollars. Get you the cult Sonic Temple. John Bellion, twenty dollars. The newest John Bellion. Glory Sound Prep, and Buena Vista Social Club, thirty-three bucks. Had the companion came out for record store day. I don't know. If, I think I might be sold out of that, but. All right, guys. That's the big stuff from this week. Check it all on the website, toadhallonline.com. It's in the uh, in the description down there, the link. You guys call the store, 815-226-1259. I might pick up, Annette might pick up, Pat might pick up. Who knows? Someone will pick up. Uh, check out uh, the morning show coming up on Tuesday and uh, lots of fun stuff in the meantime. So thanks so much for watching. See you soon.